Hello everyone. Welcome back to another exciting After Effects tutorial. In this tutorial, you'll learn to create sparkling star animation. This is a very short and easy tutorial. You can apply it to any text or logo. And you can download the project file. The download link is in the description. So, let's get started. First of all, open Adobe After Effects. Go to the composition. And create a new composition. Rename it to the Sparkling Star, or whatever name you like. Set the resolution to 500 by 500 pixels, and duration to 3 seconds. Then hit OK. Now, go to the toolbar, and select the Star Tool. Set the fill color to solid white color, and set the stroke color to none. Now, hold and drag the mouse to create a star. Align it to the center. Now, this is a normal star. We need to change it to sparkling star. Rename the shape layer. Now, under the shape layer properties. Then under the poly star. We can increase or decrease the star points. But, we need 4 points for the sparkling star. We can also change the inner radius. But we need thin points. So change the inner radius value to 5 points. Change the outer radius to 200%. And inner roundness to 200%. Let's align the star to the center, to make the perfect rotation. We can't see any animation is happening, so, let's animate the star. Make sure, you are at the first frame. Press R to open rotation properties. Click this stopwatch icon to add a keyframe. Go to about 2 seconds on the timeline. Change the rotation to 1 round. Let's preview it. Cool. Now, go to the first frame. Press S to open scale properties. Add a keyframe of 0% value. Again go to about 2 seconds. Add another keyframe with a 0% value. Finally, go to 1 second. And change the scale value to 100%. Let's preview it. Cool. It looks perfect to me. Now, select the layer, and hit you on the keyboard to open keyframes. Select all keyframes. Right click, and go to keyframe assistant. And choose easy ease. The shortcut key is F9. Everything looks perfect to me. Let's render it. Select the composition. Go to composition and add to render queue. Click the lossless. Change the format type to QuickTime. Set the channels to RGB plus alpha. Go to format options. And set the video codex to PNG. Click render. Let me show you how you can add the sparkling star to the image or text. So, follow the next step. Step number 2. Create a new project in Adobe After Effects. Go to Composition, and create a new composition. I am calling it Sparkling Star Tutorial. Set the resolution to 1920 by 1080 pixels. Frame rate to 30 frames per second and duration to 10 seconds. Now, go to File, and import the sparkling star footage and images.
Drag the trophy image into the composition. You can download the trophy image. Check the description. Now, drag the sparkling footage, just above the image layer. Go to effects and presets. Search the effect glow. Drag and drop the glow to the star footage. Reduce the star scale to 30%. Now, duplicate the footage 7 to 8 times. And place it to the image in a random position. Let's drag each layer to change the timing. Right click on random layers, and, go to time, and click time reverse layer. Set the time cursor to 3 seconds, and press N to select the work area. Let's preview it. Cool. It looks amazing. Let's apply to another image. Create a new composition. Drag and drop the text image. Now, drag the star footage just above the text layer. Let me do it faster to save your time. Let's preview it. Amazing. Everything looks perfect to me. And I am happy with the results. I hope you've learned a lot from this tutorial and that you can apply these skills to your own workflow. If you are new to this channel, please support me and subscribe to this channel. I'll see you next time on Rizat Graphics. Thank you so much for watching. Good luck.